once again the magic words, Royal Command Performance, have brought an army of sightseers flocking to the Palladium to share the thrill of variety's most lavish evening. As always, London's policemen were wonderful, and they had to be, as the milling thousands formed a high tide of enthusiasm and goodwill. Walkie Talkie Radio had a part to play, as excitement reached a new peak with the appearance of the first arrivals. Every name was a famous one, and each got a welcome on the grand scale. America's chief contribution, Danny Kay, had to do a quick dash to a side door. Still, he found time to wave to the fans before reaching his dressing room all in one piece. And so, to the moment for which all had been waiting, the arrival of the royal party. Princess Margaret and the Duke of Edinburgh accompanied their majesties, the Queen a radiant figure in white satin and diamonds. Another vast greeting was to follow in the packed auditorium as their majesties took their places in the royal box. The command show was on. Comedy, of course, was the keynote, and here it was in full measure, quickening the tempo and getting the laughs. <laughs> The one and only Danny Kay gave an act which had everything and got a reception to match. <laughs> then a last minute surprise as Danny reappeared and went underneath the arches with our own Bud Flanagan and Chez Allen. Two proud wives, Mrs. Danny Kay and Mrs. Bud Flanagan, shared royal congratulations after Variety's greatest day of the year. <laughs>